Okay, Mark, um, it's only now three weeks away from the start of the 2013 British Champion Series and kicks off with the Guinness Festival at Newmarket and you've been lucky enough to win both the 2000 and the 1000 Guineas, 1994 with Mr Bailey's, 2004 with Attraction. How is it winning those first two classics of the season? Um, they were very different sort of races for me. Mr Bailey's went in there at 16 to 1 and um, although we were for novices at the time very very confident uh, having won the Royal Lodge in his previous start it was very different from Attraction who was a champion two year old and started favourite in the Guineas but um, still fantastic races to win I got a huge thrill out of both of them uh, Mr Bailey's really was a major milestone putting us on the map and Attraction at the time was far and away the most successful horse I'd ever had she went from that Guineas to win her next three starts um, and you know, three group ones in the, the trot at the beginning of that year. It was wonderful. And moving on to your Guineas hopefuls, um, you've got Heavy Metal who's entered in the 2000 Guineas. You had quite a busy juvenile campaign, won three times, won the Richmond. Um, how hopeful are you, are you now coming into his three-year-old campaign and him stepping up to a mile? He looks great. Um, he is, as we discussed with attraction, he's another one of these horses we say, well, you know, he's proven at six furlongs, does he stay beyond? And there's some doubt of that. Um, he is a group two winner, and my normal policy with a horse that I'd won a group two as a, as a two-year-old would be go to go straight to the guineas and avoid the trials, which I don't really find as being that attractive financially to a, to a horse of that calibre. Um, but in his case, I might well run him in a trial just because we do have serious doubts about whether he'll get the guineas trip. Um, and you know, until we try, we're not going to know. Your 1,000 guineas hopeful, Bailey's Jubilee, she also won three times at, at, at two years. Again, she's only raced at five, six furlongs so far. How, how, you know, how, how is she, and are you confident of her stepping up to a mile as well? Um, we've had a little setback with her in that she's got a quarter crack. Um, it's one we would normally be dealing with if we weren't so close to uh, the guineas and we're having to just try and live with it really it's a very small quarter crank very near the, the, the bulb of the heel so we're hoping we can live with it um, she's not been lame at all on it and she's been working extremely well uh, we've been really delighted with the way she's been working and the way she's been settling she has been working over a mile she's been working with he heavy metal and we've been really impressed with the way she's relaxed and she's getting the trip very well. She's different from some of my Guineas horses of the past in that although she's third in a group one, um, she hasn't actually won a group race. So again, there's the incentive there to take her to one of the trials and I think it is quite likely that she will go to the Nelgwyn. How, how pleased were you with that Chiefly Park performance? I was absolutely delighted with it. Uh, she's a horse that, that improved throughout the year. I think when we went and um, won a listed race in France as a few people thought she was a bit lucky and that it would just, was a bit of good placing but uh, she you know she came on in, from strength to strength really and I think there was a I lose track a little bit because she raced from very early in the year she won at Kempton first time out and then she won very well at Newmarket and then we had the big disappointment at Sandown and that's I think when people thought she was just maybe a, an early season wonder and um, that, that we'd got lucky to, to get these wins early on but she's matured into a very nice horse and to say really relaxed you know we also thought there would be problems of getting the horse to settle over the longer trip but so far certainly at home that's not the case.